I'm off to finally get these sorted out. I find it so strange being out and about without a pram now because Nate's staying in and looking after Alex. Like, he's not in. He's not in uni today. It's like you constantly think, "Oh my God, I've forgotten something," and you like you just feel so empty without your baby changing bag and stuff like that. But it's nice. I can walk faster, get places quicker. I went down steps with such ease. This is service to Rochdale. You know when your hair's been styled at the hairdressers but then like the wind doesn't allow it to be nice anymore. So I've got that now and Nate loves my hair, don't you? Yeah, love her. <laughs> and while I've been out, Nate's been to Morrison's and we're having that's a cooked chicken. A full cooked chicken for three pounds. Isn't that good? Yes. <laughs> We've got some paninas who are having chicken and cheese and paninas. I think my kitchen's looking quite nice now. And eat at the table. And I went to IKEA last night and got some classic IKEA plants. They're not real plants. It means I'm not gonna kill them like like these ones. Patiently for me. Morning, me, Emily and Rasheen are going for a walk around Wardle Res, I'm not sure, um, but we're taking Emily's dog and we're taking Ali as well so it's going to be a bit of a squeeze in the car and we're also bringing pet lunches but I didn't, I didn't even have any bread in so it's like a, a weird makeshift pet lunch but I'm excited, got my wellies on and I'm ready. Hello Mr Happy, do you like your outfit? We've got foxy socks, foxy jumper. And our lovely woolly hat. Look at this. He's never worn this before. It looks well cute. He's got matching, matching gloves as well. Are you going to be toasty and warm on our walk? You are. very windswept. Is your hair windswept? Not quite. Ollie was quite good actually. I think it might have been a little bit cold for him but and he had a bit of a cry. 
players generally quite good and they had a little sleep at the end. Did you get some fresh air, Ellie? And it was such a nice day as well. It was really sunny outside and nice. Nice to get some good fresh air. You probably never guess what we're about to go and do. We're gonna go out for tea. We're gonna go to the gallows again where Jess works, my sister. Cause it's quite nice there. And it's only up the hill. Ollie, look at his big boy shoes. I just realised we've all got our brown shoes on. Brown shoes, brown shoes, brown shoes. He should be working. <laughs> Stood up. <laughs> oh, well done, Ellie. Have you eaten all that? Just finished the steak. We just finished the steak. Now you want some more of it. Clever boy sitting on his own. What? And those really, really tasty hands. We're on our way to baby sensory class. It's really nice and sunny again today. Are we the first people here? Are we? <laughs> Ooh, that thing scares me. It's meant to start at 10, and um, it's nearly 10 past and I'm the only person here. <laughs> Is it just going to be us, Ali? Well, that was fun, I enjoyed it. We've been twice now to Baby Sensory. Um, I'm glad someone else turned up though. Four other people turned up, so that's nice. And there are really nice people as well. There's no one, I won't say there's anyone there my age. They're all, everyone's still fairly young. We yeah, really loved it. I can't film an awful lot because obviously I can't film their babies without their permission. But yeah, I loved it. And he fell asleep at the end, which was cute. Come on, Ellie, I want to go out for walks. Stop being so lazy. That's a nice smile. Come on, then. <laughs> got our coats on and we're going to go for a lovely walk, aren't we, Ellie? Get you some fresh air. <laughs> There's two hang gliders up there. Over, like, the motorway. That seems safe. Fresh new tarmac under your pram wheels. Thank you for again for watching this week. I'll get down here with Ollie. Not that he's awake, he's asleep. There's yeah, some exciting news this week. Some of you might know, some of you might not. I got one of the sponsorships from the Channel Mum website and I couldn't actually believe it when I got the email on, uh, I think it was Tuesday. And I opened it and I got like, you know that feeling like, say you know when you've passed your driving test, I felt like that, I was like, ah. <laughs> so I was really excited, I'm so 
looking forward to like doing all the videos and stuff for him. So yeah, I can't wait to can't wait to get on with it. So happy and congratulations to everyone else who got it as well and good luck to anyone else applying for it um for the next few months. Bye!